Siso pushes that to Trolliano, looking downfield. Trolliano, Sangalang in front of him, and unable to complete the pass. Now on the run, Calvin Abueva to Tyler Bay. Bay with the finish. Jolalon tries to get a second chance opportunity. No. Oh, look at Halalon there. Out rebounding Junmar Fajardo. Ian Sangalang, the bump and the finish, and that is because Gio Alalon back on the stat sheet, but it's his leadership they want magnified on the floor. Ian said the way he's been playing is his way of thanking the management for such an incredible opportunity, especially since when he was ill. You never know. Yeah, but I can guarantee, Coach, when I was watching the PBA, 98, 99, Gio Alalon future PBA player, so it doesn't happen all the time. <laughs> <laughs> just this mere presence just changes the complexion of things here. And Sangala for options. Finds Cyrus Jonisho. He likes that spot. Jonisho yes. gets a big three. Simon and Ciso, bad miss there. It falls straight to Mark Baroka. Paul Lee finding in Sangala inside. An easy bucket. High percentage. And Magnoli are climbing back into this one. Mark Baroka. Now in Sangala. Great find to Gio Halalon, and that's a foul and one. Jumar Mahardo saddled with that one. And a foul. Let's take a look at that again. Great find there. Sorry, Gio Halalon. Halalon. Yeah, Halalon. 27 for him as Ian Sangalang able to collect that pass. Working on Jumar Mahardo. Jumar with one leg, a series of fakes, and end one. Let's take a look at this. Count how many fakes. One, two, three. Paul stays true to his game, everything will just fall into place and everyone else will follow, gentlemen. Thank you very much, Denise, for that report. Of course, right now, it is Magnolia who get an easy two inside.